And business is booming for some Bay Area tech companies tonight as demand skyrockets for a more hands-off approach to food preparation. KTI X5's Joe Vasquez shows us the robots that could soon be staffing your favorite restaurants. You want fries with that? A robot may soon have you covered. Same goes for your smoothie. You choose the ingredients, the machine from Blended blends it. It used to be forward thinking that you have to use robotics and AI to automate food preparation and delivery. So it's not future anymore. It is right here, right now. Sales have at least quadrupled or demand has quadrupled for sure. Rick Wilmer of Chowbotics based in Hayward says right now people want food that hasn't touched other human hands. Sally now makes custom-made salad bowls for sale in nursing homes, military bases, and grocery stores. I mean, the comfort level with getting food from a robot or a machine has clearly changed as a result of the pandemic, where people are now looking for this. Restaurants are also looking to do better at social distancing employees. That's where Flippy, the White Castle robot, could help. But maybe a human will be operating the grill and not standing next to another human uh, who might have been operating the fryer. And so... So it just allows more space in the kitchen. Companies are automating point of retail. They're automating kitchens, but that's not enough. Max Elder of the Food Futures Lab in Palo Alto says the problems of the pandemic are not going to be solved by robots alone. For example, he is urging humans to decrease our demand for animal meat. Over 35,000 workers in meatpacking facilities have been infected with COVID-19. These are hot spots of this pandemic. It is incumbent upon us to appreciate that we play a role in those outbreaks. Joe Vasquez, KPIX5. Sally, the Hayward-based salad bowl robot, is only being used on the East Coast right now. She will be back to the Bay Area sometime in the next few months.